back to my channel my name is Leia and this is budget with Leia today we're gonna be doing a bill exchange video so I have quite a lot of placeholders right here just in case I need them I don't know how much I will actually need but I have them just in case and then I have my little notebook just to jot down what I'm taking back to the bank um, so I'll have that onto the side in case you're wondering where I'm writing stuff okay so let's start off We're gonna go with Mateo. <clears throat> so we have some placeholders. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. Okay. So we're gonna keep $50. And there should be 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, and 100. And we have another $100 taken to the bank. Money decided to fly away. Okay, so we have 1,100. 1,000. <laughs> oh my gosh. 1,000, 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 45, and 50. So I don't have any 50s or 10s right now. So if I do get them, I might come back here. But otherwise, I'm okay with that. Okay, so Isaac's envelope should be the same. So we're going to keep 20, 40, 45, 50, 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, and 100. And then another $100 placeholder. And now it has 1,000, 100, 200, 300. 20, 40, 45, 50. Okay, next up is car maintenance. Car maintenance has $1,000 in the bank and then $200 in cash. Um, let's keep $100 in cash and let's take $100 to the bank. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 1. I think that is gonna be good. So 1,100, 20, 40, 60, 81. Um, I like to keep some in cash just in case I do decide I want to do a car wash or um, anything small for the car. Um, I don't want to keep pulling back and forth my savings account. Um, and now that I have tens, I'm actually going to switch out those two fives for tens on the on my nephew's envelopes. So. Okay, there we go. Let's see, next up is car insurance. And then this has 875, uh, $600 are in the bank. So my car insurance payment is not due till mid-August. So, you know, I'm gonna put this in the bank. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 82. So that's 200. 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75. Um, and I don't have any tens, so we're just going to keep it like that. So we added another 200. So 5, 6, 7, 8, 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75. Okay. Okay, next up is Christmas. Christmas is fully funded at $1,000. So there's $500 in the bank, so this should be 500. So 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85. So 500 dollars is gonna go to the bank for Christmas. And I have 500 dollars in the bank. So I'm just gonna switch that out for a one thousand dollar placeholder. Uh, let's do this one. And that is technically fully funded for 2023. I will probably still stuff it and then start doing 2024 because you know what? I, I don't mind starting for next year, you know? It feels like I'm, I'm accomplishing something. <laughs> uh, pet care. Pet care has 431. My cat is running around, you know, doing her thing. Um, I can't do anything for um, pet care. 
and family has only 40 something 43 yeah okay occasions has 72 um let's switch out the fives so 5 10 15 20 for just a 20 dollar bill now 20 40 60 70 71 72 and that's it for this binder okay next up is my black row term so health <sighs> health has 570 and there is four hundred dollars in the bank mm. and i constantly pull this every week so i'm just oh i thought i had a 10th never mind <laughs> now you know what i'm just gonna leave it yeah because i do pull from this every week and i don't want to put too much money in the bank if I if I need it so we're just gonna leave it there house has one ten thousand not ten one thousand twenty um so these are all placeholders so what I'm just gonna do is I'm gonna switch these placeholders for a one thousand dollar one so So it has 1,020 still, just in smaller placeholder denominations. Okay, so moving has 280, um, and I can't do anything there. Let's see, purchases has 370, and there's $200 in the bank. Um, I'm there's so many things I want to buy, like. I think I'm okay with not buying the vacuum. I think we're we were able to fix it. Cross your fingers. Um, but I also need a new um chair. Um, like a work chair chair for my desk really. And I was looking at prices and it's like two hundred and something dollars. And I don't know if I should put some of this money in the bank. I might just switch it out. So let's see. Let's do the 5, 10, 15, 20. And just put a 20 down. I think that's going to be good. So 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 60, 70. So 370. Tech. Tech has 762. And there's $500 in the bank. So we're going to leave 62. So 1, 2, 20, 40, 60. And then one and two. Ooh, I'm gonna switch out these ones. I don't have any change. Okay. 62, so this should be 200. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 80, 92. Okay. So one and two. So it has 500, 600. 700, 20, 40, 60, 1, 2. So 62 for tech. Um, I'm going to go back to my health envelope real quick and switch out the fives for E10. Okay, so next up is actuary. And it has 200 in the bank, and it's 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55. So, this should be 40. So, I have still 100, 200, 20, 40, 50, and 55. vacation has 580 so 10 20 30 35 40 and it has 500 20 40 60 80 okay okay so that's it for this binder I didn't really pull much out of that one did I huh? just switch out some bills okay next up is 
my more fun binder. So YouTube has $100. Um, so I'm just gonna switch out for some tents. Um, I think I might be doing something soon. I don't know. So don't want too high on denominations. Maybe? I don't know. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, what? Nails has 50. So we're gonna keep that and this should be 40. So 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. So 50 silk. Gaming has 80. So we're gonna do, we're just gonna do 20. Mostly because I think I might be buying some games um, soon. They're having a Steam summer sale and I do wanna buy some games. So 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80. And I do wanna have some change in there if I do buy something. Uh, this name has $600. So this should be 100. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, and 100. So we're gonna put that in the bank and take a $100 placeholder. And now it has $600 for Disney. So that's exciting, another little milestone that I reached recently. Okay, Black Friday has $300. So I thought about it, and Black Friday is not till November. So I'm just gonna put all this money in the bank. Um, it should be $300. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 60, 80, 2, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, or 300. So I'm gonna pull one, two, three hundred dollars for Black Friday. And that's gonna go to the bank. And then Halloween is fully funded at 150. So I don't have a $50 placeholder, but I do have a fully funded placeholder. So I'm just gonna use that. So I'm gonna put 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 50. So 150 is gonna go to the bank. Um, and then I, this is from Carol Cash. I think this is a freebie. Um, I don't know when I completed it, but I'm just gonna write Halloween right here. Just because. So that was completed and I won't need to stuff that for a long time. Halloween's not until October and it's what, July? Okay, so that's it for that. <clears throat> and then in here, I don't have that much money in here. So I don't know if I really need to condense this. Maybe a little bit. Should be 109. Okay, yeah, we'll condense this. Let's see. Let's do the ones first. So one, two, three, four, five. And then one, two, three, four, three, twenty. So I usually like to keep changing here because I do use it quite often. So this still should be 109. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 100, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, <clears throat> 109. Uh, gas is still the same. Eating, spending has $1. Eating out has $6. Miscellaneous has 10 Okay, that is fine. Okay, last up is my savings challenge binder. So we're gonna go into my emergency savings. So quick story on this. I completely ripped part of this at the top. Like the little, um, what's it called? This little plasticky thing came off and I was trying to put it, put it on. And then I thought, hey, if I do this, this and this, I'll, I can put it back on. And then I ended up ripping it and then I was like, what if I can make this envelope like the other envelopes that I have and then just, you know, make it open, right? And then this happened and now I really am not a fan 
and I regret doing this, but you know, I guess it works. It's a little pocket, but I might switch it out for something else. And I really like this font and this like vinyl and stuff, but it is what it is. <laughs> okay, so my emergency fund. My emergency fund has $10,020. So $20. This should be $10,000 in placeholders minus that $100 actual uh, cash. So I'm not going to count it because I've counted it multiple, multiple times already. So this is $10,000. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to replace that with a $10,000 placeholder from Carol Cash and then put all the other ones back. Okay, so now I have way more placeholders as well. So this is exciting. I love all these placeholders. Okay, so this $100 is also going to go to the bank. So I need to make sure I write that down. So emergency fund, $100 is actually going to the bank. Everything else was placeholder money. So now it has 10,020 and it's so much easier to count that. And that is so exciting. That's so pretty. Okay. Um, everything else, I don't really know if I really need to switch out any of these savings challenges. Um, Maybe I'll do a 10 or something. Nothing too exciting. Um, I usually end up making change in these envelopes anyway. Um, Kirby challenge. Mm, let's do another 10. And then the Tetris challenge. Tetris challenge is pretty, um, pretty full of ones. So let's see, 10, 15, 10, 15, 20, 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Um, okay, so this is 20. Just gonna keep those some of the ones i always feel like i need change i think my nephew's getting in trouble downstairs <laughs> yep he's getting in trouble um okay so that's it for this binder as well that is it that is it for this bill exchange not sure how much money that is though let's see uh 100 200 300 uh 500 1000 1 400 550 650? Is that correct? Yeah. 1650. So let's see, I have let's see, hundred dollar bills. I have twenties, and then I have tens, fives, and ones. So I have one of those, and then how many ones do I have? Actually, you know what? Before I do that, this is how much money is actually going to go to the bank. So this is a pretty, pretty good stack. And I will say a good amount of them are 20s. So let's start off. So we know there's 100. Let's do the 20s. 20, 40, 60, 80. 1, 20, 40, 60, 80. 2, 20, 40, 60, 80. 3, 20, 40, 60, 80. 4, 20, 40, 60, 85. 20, 40, 60, 80. 1, 20, 40, 60, 80. 2, 20, 40, 60, 80. 3, 20, 40, 60, 80. 4, 20, 40, 60, 85. 1,000. 20, 40, 60, 80. 1, 20, 40, 60, 80. 2, 20, 40, 60, 80. 3, 320, 40, 60. So that's 1,360. Okay. So that is the 20s. Let's do the 10s next. 10, so 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 100 for 
tins. Okay, so fives. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80. Okay, so 280. And then, I don't know how much this is. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, 10 exactly. Okay, so 10. So that is 1,300, 500. I don't know what I did wrong. <laughs> and I don't want to count this again. I got, so that's four, 14, 150, 250, 450, 550. So I, this is like 1850. So there's $200 more here than here. And I don't understand why. So maybe I forgot to write one in. <gasps> I did. Wasn't it tech? Yes, tech. Oh my gosh. I figured it out. Tech. 200. So this should be 1850. Okay. <laughs> so I counted it correctly. I just forgot to write in tech. Okay. So it matches. So we're good. <laughs> I was like, I'm pretty sure I ever I added everything correctly. All right, so $1,850 is gonna go back to my high yield savings account to earn, I believe it's 4% interest. And I'm getting about $60 in interest every single month, which is about, what, six and 12? About $720 every year in just interest uh, that they're paying me for having that money in there. And honestly, that's free money. So <laughs> at the end of the year, I will take that interest and allocate it into my funds. Uh, right now it's just being like held in its own little account for now um, because I didn't really know what I wanted to do with that extra money, but I'm just gonna allocate it to other funds at the end of the year. So when that day comes um, for the new year, you're gonna see that. Thank you for like, you know, sitting through my little mishap at the end there, uh, but I counted it correctly. I just forgot to write in one of the uh, uh, amounts that I pulled, but that's okay. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll be seeing you guys next time. Bye.